Hey guys, here we are, me and Sue Bear. <laughs> he just came in, so I thought I'd snag him and I told him he's a YouTube sensation. <laughs> okay, so I got some really cool things I wanted to show you guys. Um, my husband's uncle is um, a woodworking uh, craftsman and um, he's disabled right now. He had um, been doing some, um, I don't know, he did something where he fell off of a roof. So right now he's out of work. And uh, he's been really enjoying my soaps. Uh, I've been making that chocolate soap for him. This one. And he's been raving about it and he also works on cars. So this is amazing. He worked on my car yesterday and his black hands came nice and clean and he loves how soft they they are instead of being rough and hard and so I have been making this for him but anyway he was home messing around and he made me some beautiful soap molds that I've been asking my husband for a few years to make or I could have done it myself but this one I love aren't they real sturdy beautiful I said you need to sell those and then he also made me a loaf a big one but this one's gonna go back to him it's a little too wide and he said he'd put a divider in for me but I mean what a what a great guy so this is the other thing that he made for me I don't know. It's a soap cutter. <laughs> okay, look at this. Now it only cuts one at a time. And I haven't made any soap because I've been busy making fairy houses and swimming in the creek. It's been sweltering here. So, um,. Oh, you could see I cut up all these little pieces. I was going bananas. So he made me this awesome little cutter, and uh, it's got the, the cute little handle, and he's gonna work on a prototype to do like 12 at once, but this is great for me because I'm, it does the trick, and I was so excited because at least now I'll be able to have um, clean lines and they won't be all crooked, and um, I just gave him a guitar string off of uh, one of the kids' guitars. So he's working on other designs, but um, I said, oh my goodness, a lot of the soapers are gonna go crazy over something like this because the price is really good. He said for something like this, he would maybe charge like $45, and then you'd have to pay shipping. So, I mean, it's great because you have all that space, I don't know how, you have all this space, you know, for your loaf and, and all that, so. So yeah, this is one of my aprons. Um, let me show you the bottom. Kind of hanging out today. Um, I wanted a cupcake apron. Uh, I had special ordered it from an uh, Etsy seller uh, for my birthday, and two months in advance, and she never came through. So for my birthday, I was left high and dry. So. Because I knew I had wanted to get a lavender cupcake apron since lavender is my favorite color. So I found another seller on Etsy and she's uh, Fun and Flirty Aprons by Shauna. And um, she made, uh, this is the one that I found. They do cost a little bit more, you guys, but they're neat, you know, for the market and stuff like that. So this was the first one that I had gotten. So it's got the cupcakes on the bottom, and then it's got the bubble gum, and then it has cupcake applique. Super cute, but then when I went on her site, then after I ordered these two, then she had this one. So I had to get this one because it's all lavender. So get check this one. It's Care Bears. And when my son saw it, he was like, oh mommy, that's a princess apron. 
So I had to get this one when I bought the first one. But these are cute, you know, they're a little bit more, but for the market and stuff, I think they're a lot of fun. And she's really cool because she'll make you whatever that you want. And she said to me, anytime I wanted something custom, she, she would have made it. So if anybody's ever looking for some fun cupcake aprons, there's other ones too, like I've showed you. I, I've made some, and um, but yeah, I threw this on because I'm just, I've been hanging out here at the house. So anyway, I wanted to show you guys my awesome new self cutter, and um, show you. I have a couple more videos I'm gonna do because I've been working on um, some other fairy houses and stuff. So yeah, so I'll keep you guys updated if anybody's ever interested in a in a um, soap cutter. Like I said, he's still working on designs and stuff like that, and the soap molds. He's um, you know, I love to help out our local. Um, hard-working um, people so anyway I thought I'd share this with you I'm super excited can't wait to make some soap so I can cut up a whole loaf and actually show you cutting with this instead of me with my big old knife butchering up my soap so anyway I'll see you guys soon I, I'm gonna do a cupcake haul I think with uh, all my Dollar General stuff so I'll see you soon bye